go. So I'm in the Uber on my way to the airplane for the conference in North Carolina. I'm going to be uh, preaching on Friday. It's a great lineup. So hopefully I can take you along with me. Um, I guess when I get to the Airbnb, I'll uh, pick the camera back up. And my daughter is meeting me too. So I will see you soon. So guys, this is my Airbnb that my sis Kendra hooked me up with because you guys know I'm out here in North Carolina, Fayetteville. It is beautiful. Fit for me, the queen. Everything is brand new, guys. I am the first person in here, okay? So this is the bathroom that uh, my daughter will be using. This is the room my daughter is going to be staying in. And it's so cool. She got her own bathroom here. This one is beautiful, guys. And then it's like little closets and stuff. Y'all don't need to see all that. This is actually... Hold on, guys. Let there be light. This is another bathroom that I have. And this is my room. And check out her mirror. She's just too cute. Look at the mirror, guys. Eh. And this is me, Pastor Fair. This is me, Pastor Fair. <laughs> Y'all know Pastor is crazy, but yeah, I had on all black with my little orange puff and my white Converse. You know what I'm saying? Then you know, iced out. Hold on, hold on. iced out. You know what I'm saying? Guys, best. You know what I'm saying? Versace shades. I mean, no, no these ain't the shades. These are my Versace glasses. Iced in the air. You know, you know what I'm saying? God's best. <laughs> but God. This place is beautiful. Like, it is really. Oh, so, so, so. it is really nice. I love it here. I'm going to sleep so good. Tomorrow I'm preaching. I'm going to tear the house down. But I will check in with you guys. Um, If we go off tonight, I'll check on and do a, a fit check. If not, I will definitely um check in with you guys tomorrow before I go to preach. Love you. Hey, look who I found, my twin. My baby here to hold her mama down. We demon bullies. All right, she's doing a lot. She look cute, y'all. She look cute or whatever. Okay, okay, okay. All right, guys, so this is what I'm wearing to preach in. This is something simple, because I had an issue with my outfit that I bought, but it's okay, I still look cute. We still bring in the glory. My face. Hopefully I can get some footage um, inside that you see God's glory. But um, yeah, we about to bring it in Jesus' name. I'm ready. Yeah. Sis, we ready. Everybody's here. Oh yeah, you look beautiful. Oh, look at me. Wait, hold on. Let me. So what's up, babe? Uh, I'm about to say Facebook, YouTube. Um, that's how you know I be on Facebook and all that too much. So yesterday I, I taught, when I tell you that God used me, like he shifted that whole room. When I tell you everybody was like quiet, God shifted that whole room. I'm going to see if I could try to insert some clips, but when you walk in purpose, when you trust God and you don't try to be popular, you don't try to do too much, you just do what he placed in you, there is a sense of power and flow that goes with that. Like, I was just being authentically me, being myself through the Holy Ghost. And when I tell you, he shifted that room. I am getting so many inboxes, so many DMs about how my message stuck to them and change them see that's the thing we don't it's okay to hoop and holler like, oh it's a good message no 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 did it change you people are like yo i'm not gonna be doing sorcery i'm not gonna be doing sage all those angel numbers um i'm gonna be reading my bible you made me want to get back in my bible that's what it's all about man so if i could do anything just i want to encourage you just do whatever god calls you to do don't worry about all that other stuff like God will provide. If he called you to do something, he will provide for you. You just got to do what he told you to do. You just got to do the work. 
Um, I know this vlog might not be too long or, you know, um, I keep forgetting to pick it up because yesterday I was like fasting and just in the moment because I knew God was going to use me. But um, I just really want to tell you guys that I love y'all to health. Thank you for subscribing to my channel, for rocking with me, um, you know, for believing in me. And I just pray that if you don't get anything else from my channel that you get, just follow your dreams and just do it. You know, God will bring the increase when he feels like you can handle the increase. Amen. That's what I'm learning. I keep praying for it. I keep expecting it. But ultimately, it's his timing and he's going to do it when he knows I'm ready. But my job is to get ready, stay ready and stay in expectance glory to god all right y'all so i'm going to lay here a little bit longer because i'm tired we got part two tonight tonight's the um the black lux extravaganza with the entrepreneurs all of them are multi-millionaires so that'll be good i'm i'm gonna look so pretty and you know we just gonna um i got a gift for the girl who hosted so we're gonna present her gift to her. i got her a nice little um bracelet from pandora just to show her my appreciation for her and you know this was her first conference and she had me on so that was nice of her and you know all god but i'm just sinking in a moment i'm just so grateful to god that he used me like it feels good to be used by god if we're gonna be used can we get, can we be used by god like, if we're going to be out here getting used, can it be for his glory? Amen. Love you guys. All right. So, what up, guys? Um, I'm checking in. It is Sunday. I didn't go to um, the Black Lux part. Um, I probably, once I get home, talk more about that. I'm actually about to teach. I'm about to get ready to teach for Pray to Slay Ministries. Um, we're going home today, so I'm just, you know, getting my things together, packing up. I miss my sons, and, you know, me and KK, we... We ready to go home, okay? Let's just say that we ready to go home. Um, it was a blessing I got to teach. Oh my goodness. So many people learned so much, but I also saw a lot. Um, some things I'm not happy about, some things I am happy about. But um, for the most part right now, I just got my mind ready. I'm ready to preach the word of God. Um, really teach, because I'm really becoming a great teacher. And um, yeah, so by the time I see you, um, Lord willing, I'll be home and, you know, hopefully I remember to pick it up. I am a little frustrated that I didn't go to the Black Lux um, part of the uh, conference because I had my banging shoes in my dress. I was, oh, oh, she was going to kill it. But Holy Spirit said, don't go. I listen to God no matter how much I want to do something. I listen to God and he knows best. So it's about, let's see. This Airbnb is so nice, guys. It is about, it's 8.43. I preach at 9. So, I'm going to finish getting myself ready. I just got on my, I pray the slate shirt, my original. I, I'm going to come back with these. Some little fitted, because I'm wearing my Converse, hair pack, red lip, glasses, period. You know, shaded the eyelashes and a little something, something. Just something so I can look decent to teach the word. And enough to get on this airplane to go, huh? All right, guys, I'll see you soon. Walking inside here, my new spot. All right, guys, so I just finished the gym. Oh my God, I love LA Fitness. Like, um, hopefully I can get like more footage and stuff when I'm in there, but the kickboxing, like everything that I do, they have there. And it just feels like, a, it does feel like an upgrade. I remember I always wanted to um, join LA Fitness, but back in the day, they used to be like mad expensive for no reason, like $100 for the plan I have now. You know what I mean? I think it's like $35 and then two of my sons could come with me. I could bring two people with me. And then I also got this. They have a smoothie bar. I'm like, yes, I felt like a real, um, which, you know how the YouTubers be at them upscales gyms. I was like, yes, pal. It's going to really encourage me to get this weight off. So I just did some kickboxing. I did 30 minutes of cardio on a treadmill just walking. Um, the older I get because I am 39. And this is apple, carrot, and ginger, I believe. This is fresh, um, fresh juice. I watched her do it from the juicer. But the older I'm getting, I'm learning from a lot of people who used to work out a lot and used to run. They said that running is not really good on the knees after a while. And I'm just like, you know what? Nothing beats walking. So I just do like a brisk walk. Like uh, sometimes I go up to like four, um, but 2.3. I usually do like 2.3, 2.5 and just do it for like 30 minutes. But um, yeah, I have like 50 pounds I have to lose. And I'm not a bad looking woman, you know what I'm saying? But 
the truth of the matter sometimes weight can you know it takes a toll on you i'll be feeling tired i can see certain areas where like your neck gets dark and stuff from too much insulin and it's just not healthy it's not even about looks it's just about health so what i'm gonna do now is i have to go to the bank because i want to get my hair done this is really good y'all and i told you i wanted to get my hair done but um the tips they can't you can't tip on a card they want cash so i just got to go like take out 20 dollars and then over there is um the shop right so i'm gonna just pick up a couple of things and everything so um yeah that's what i'm about to do i don't know if i'm gonna bring y'all in the shop right with me or i might pop in again at the hair place i don't know but i just really feel good i'm outside I was I told you I got I wasn't I don't know if I told you I wasn't feeling well this week so I got my COVID test everything was negative and I'm just enjoying my time I do have to put gas in this car I'm like dreading the last time I put gas in this car was $99 that is crazy y'all but I'm about to I've been listening to my gospel now I'm listening to my R&B I got this 90s track it is banging I'm about to finish listening to some of that ride to get this $20 out I'm gonna pick up a stuff, a couple of stuff for the house. Might as well drop it off and then go to the um, beauty um, salon. Hopefully, I can make it to the beauty salon today. Cause you know how that is. Once you get in the house, you be like, I don't feel like going. But I look like a little old lady. This ponytail, it, my scalp is so dirty. I just need some TLC up in this head. So that's what I'm about to do. But again, I love Planet Fitness because it was like. First of all, the price is crazy. $20, you could bring an extra person with you. It's 24 hours. You can't beat that. But it's like limited. You know what I'm saying? Like even my daughter bought this thing from this girl named Capri Curves. Y'all need to check her out on Instagram. Her body is banging naturally. And she has like this Facebook group, Capri Curves. So many great results. Like her stuff work. And then when my daughter had bought her program and then sent it to me, it's a lot of equipment that was on there that I didn't see at Planet Fitness. But they have it over here at like LA Fitness. And just like they have class. Classes. They got cycling. It's just so many things that I can do networking and meet new people and everything Especially like as a pastor you always want to put yourself out there to like meet new people, but I'm really excited about that I'm excited about this this vlogging like I'm getting serious like I don't care I, I'm not gonna say I don't care because I don't want to put that you know what you declare in the decree But I know I'm gonna after a while I'm gonna have a lot of followings and stuff But I'm just really doing this for me just documenting how far I'm you know coming in life just to see it all documented You know what I mean? Even like some of the old stuff that I was looking at um, When I was in like the other house and you know it was like dark times a little bit for me and my kids and I could just see like the difference So, you know this documentation is just great for my growth and just to see it and then like other people too who you know come along seeing a beautiful young woman you know that's not even that i'm black or anything but that i'm a christian that i'm pushing kingdom you know what i'm saying and killing it so yeah mm. this is really good y'all i use the red apple she asked me if i want a red or green apple i use the red apple that's what it is it's red apple lemon and ginger red apple lemon and ginger and it's good I gotta learn how to like do it good too when because at home I have a juicer too. All right, so at this point I'm rambling. Let me get on this highway. I'm mad hype. I'm outside. I even look vibrant. It's a vibrant thing. Hey, hey. <laughs> I bop. All right, guys. So this light is like I don't know. It's blowing mine. So I'm showing you over here. This is some of the. This is the butter sauce. Doesn't that look good? And this is the seafood, and I'm gonna put it in the bag now, and I'm gonna eat. Uh, I'll show you it how it looks in the bag. All right, guys. So this is how it looks in the bag. Doesn't that look so good? Yeah. So it's cheaper when you do this, and you get more. So I can have some all night. 